I decided to do a fine art book of my band photographs because there are so many great pictures that no one's ever seen but myself and the inside of a Kodak photo paper box. And every time I visit the contact sheets, slides that I have, there's just so many more good pictures there. In those days, there was only physical reproduction. It was on an album or in a magazine. And how many of those kind of images do you need? 20, 15? Yet I was taking hundreds of thousands of photographs. I just happened to be invited to photograph the band. They didn't exist at that point. They didn't have a name at that point. Nobody knew who they were except for Bob Dylan aficionados. So meeting them, they were, I always felt they were very special people. There was no airs about them. My images always reflect what is in front of me. It was very organic. I just let them do what they wanted to do and they liked to do what they wanted to do. This picture was done the third time that I photographed the guys. I'd gotten to know them at that point and gotten to see that they're very natural. Just by chance, I had been looking at Matthew Brady, Civil War era photographs. I put the two together, who they were with these kind of pictures, and I said this was the kind of look that expressed who they were because they were really people from another time period. They weren't psychedelic. They said they didn't want to be psychedelic. So I wanted to bring my band photographs to light for, for many years. I just haven't had the opportunity. So now with crowdsourcing, I could listen to people who are knowledgeable about what the band means, who really care about the band, who understand the importance of this group and the importance of the visual element to their story and their saga. Anyway, there's a lot of good pictures that every time I would, I would go back and look at my boxes of prints or the contact sheets or the slides that never got published, I'd feel a little bit sad. I'm thinking, boy, this is such beautiful work and it's a shame that no one but myself gets to see it. In this new book, we'll be able to get really, really rich colors and really show these pictures as they should be seen. In closing, I just want to say that I'm really, really deeply pleased and moved that I'll be able to put this work out there. And I'm very grateful for the support that I know will be forthcoming. And it's really a 40 year plus project for me to show these pictures to people. That's it, thank you.